Now, first of all, guys, so let's maybe find out a formula to find the width of a rectangle. Now, in order to find the perimeter, so P is 2L plus 2W. And if you don't know how to find the perimeter of a rectangle, make sure you click on the link that pops up right now. All right, there we go. Now, so in this question, we know that the P is equal to 2L plus 2W. Now, let us solve for width. All right, guys. So first, I'm going to transpose this 2L to the other side. So P minus 2L is equal to 2W. Right, guys. And since we are solving for the width, I'm going to transpose this width to the other side. So P minus 2L divided by 2 is equal to W. It is as simple as that, guys. So if you use this formula, we can easily find the width of a rectangle. Now let's get to it. So step number one, let us start by writing the formula down. So the formula is equal to, so width is equal to P minus 2L divided by 2. Right, guys? So all we have to do is take the values and substitute it here. So the width is equal to perimeter in this question is 60 minus 2 times length, which is 2 times 12 divided by 2. Right, guys? So what we have here? So 60 minus 2 times 12 is 24 divided by 2. And 60 minus 24 is equal to 36 divided by 2, which is 18 centimeter. So this width would be 18 centimeter. Right, guys? Now let's do one more question. So again, let's start with the formula. So the width is equal to perimeter minus 2 times length divided by 2. All right, guys. So in this case, we have the perimeter as 250 minus 2 times length, so 2 times 20 divided by 2. Right, guys? So we would have 250 minus 40 divided by 2. 250 minus 40 is 210 divided by 2, which is equal to 105 centimeter. Therefore, the width in this question would be 105 centimeter. And that is how we would find the width of a rectangle when we know its perimeter and its length. Now, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to hit on that like button and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on any future maths videos. Until next time, guys, have a nice day.